Good afternoon. So today it's a little bit different. Well, tonight it's a little bit different. I'm not going to be sleeping in the van. I'm going to be sleeping in my local woods. I'm going to do a bit of a camp over. Now, it's like nothing I've done before. I've camped in tents before and I've camped with other people before on sites and that. But I've never camped in a bivvy bag in the middle of the woods on my own. So I'm quite looking forward to it. Should be interesting. I've seen a few horror films. I've just got to try and forget them for tonight. So let's see how we get on. Okay, first things first. I need to find a suitable spot. Now, I'd like to try and keep away from the road, or as far away from the road as possible, but also try and keep off the, the main tracks so I don't get disturbed by dog walkers and the like. So this is sort of away from the main, where the main car park is, and I want to try and get deep into the woods that way. So first opportunity I'm going to shoot off. Like I said, this is all new to me, so I'm a bit apprehensive about the whole thing. Especially tonight when it's dark and the noises in the, in the forest. And I honestly don't know whether it's going to come midnight and I'm going to scurry off back to the van. I'll have to see. Okay, this spot looks as good as any. It's very quiet. I'm starting to hear some of them noises. First things first, the shelter. Okay, finally got settled. Just waiting for the uh, water to boil and uh, I'll have a cup of coffee. There's a lot of bird noise at the moment, a lot of flapping about. The light's fading so I don't know how well this is coming out. I have got a torch for later on if I do do any filming. So let's see how we go. So it's about eight o'clock and uh, I think it's as dark as it's going to get. It's very quiet. I've not, I've heard, I say I've heard the birds and that earlier on and I've disturbed a few collecting firewood. But I've not really heard anything else yet. So mind you, there's still plenty of time. I'm just uh, cooking some beans at the moment.
Well, that's me all tucked up, ready for a good night's sleep. There's a little bit of life left in the fire. Might get another hour or so out of it. See you in the morning. Good morning. I had a really good night's sleep. Really enjoyed it. I mean, I was very lucky with the weather. It wasn't forecast rain or anything, and it was a, it was a, quite a mild night. There was a few noises during the night. I think there was a badger, and I heard a fox at one point. But the rest of it was just birds, so I was I was all right. There's no problem. Most things worked out. Um, it was difficult to film last night. Um, I'm not used to filming in sort of twilight. You're restricted to what you can do and what you can't do. But after I'd done the main part of the filming, I realised that the, cap, the, the, the small fire in my Crusader pot weren't going to be big enough. So uh, I built a bigger fire. Um, I used my aluminium tray that I mentioned. And uh, I built a bit of a tripod, which was quite strong enough to do what I wanted it to do. There's a few other bits and bobs that I tried. Um, I'll show you. I made this hanger for me. Crusader cup. It just loops through the two handles. I don't know if you can see that. And then hooks on. Made a little stick there. So that can just sit on there. So that worked really well. Uh, the other thing I tried was I made a pot to put my bean tin in and then hook on that the same way and onto there but I left that on there about an hour last night and they were still frozen cold so I just ended up putting this in the fire and uh, cooked them that way so right I better clear some of this mess up all cleared up and packed away, like no one had ever been there. Let's clear off. Really enjoyed that. I think uh, before I do it again, I need to brush up on a few techniques. I think I probably ought to learn some knots and how to tie the tarp up properly. I know some people use bungee cords. They seem to keep it tight that way and that, but it was okay. But luckily there was no wind last night, so it wasn't really a problem. Right, I've got to find the van now. Well, You've got to try something different every now and again. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.